It's a Manchu, and welcome back to Days Gone. Last time I spent a considerable amount of time exploring a town and clearing out all the freaker nests. And I swear, I searched every building that there was. And something struck me after I signed off. The name of that town was Marion Forks. And that's significant because Tucker mentioned Marion Forks. She mentioned that she had some scout that was out there and saw a woman survivor in Marion Forks. And Tucker implied that she wanted Deacon to go find that person and steer them toward Hot Springs. Now, I searched every freaking building in, in that town. I'm pretty sure I did. And there were a couple places I couldn't get into. There were a couple of rooms in a hotel that were locked and I couldn't get into them. And the church was all locked up. I couldn't get into that. Otherwise, I searched every freaking building. I didn't find any survivor. But anyway, uh, at this point, I'm going to move on to Sarah's Memorial Stone. And I think maybe, hopefully, I might finally get there this time. Uh, I just cleared out this martyr camp. I'm going to search around outside a little bit for any supplies that there might be to find. Fuel up the bike if I can and then head out. I think also there might be some wolves outside. I hear some noises like there's wolves out there. All right, off we go. Wait. Hmm. Extreme fire danger, apparently. Good to know. Darn it. I thought there was a spruce sampling around here. Nice headshot. Finally. Jesus. Frickin' wolves. Well, I don't know where it is. I hear another wolf. Stupid wolves! They're just a nuisance. They're not really a threat, they're just kind of annoying. Stupid wolves. I know it's over there somewhere, but let's not worry about it. There's something around here. My spidey sense is tingling. Okay, let's take a look around. What is this? Some rope? Okay, let's see. What's going on here? There you are. What? There's some footy prints. What is this about? Gotta take a closer look. There's a clue over here. 
What the heck? Which way? Back on track. Like I lost the tracks. What the heck? I have no idea what this is. It's really kind of annoying me. Uh. There's a dot there. There's a couple dots here. Wait. Watch a murderers and vagrants. We just as soon shoot you as look at you. What are the dots on the map? What the hell? I cleared this camp! I swear to crap, I cleared this camp. Something's here. What the piss? What the piss? Why are there... Why are there enemies here again? I do not understand. I do not comprehend. I don't know what's going on. Let's see if I can hit him from here. You got me. You totally got me. Who are these people? In this area, I just freaking cleared out. What are those other symbols? around here why where did they come from can't hide in here they see me where the devil did these guys come from I freaking cleared this area out happened to him? Did he go up in the air?
There's more hostiles up here. Who are oblivious. My gosh, dude, you are so oblivious. I think I might be clear. Hey guys. You're gonna be okay. Hey, hey, it's not safe out here in the shit. I know where there's a camp. That... <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll go. I'll go. Uh let's see. Since survivors to hot springs. I don't get any uh, trust for doing that. Copeland's camp, I get trust. I want trust. Peaceful Lake. Mark Copeland. It's safe there. Uh, thank you. Uh. Tell him it was St. John. Deacon. They know. Keep your head down and run. Well, I'll be darned. I had no idea what I was doing when I was doing it, but I just did a good deed there. I, I rescued some people. I had no idea. I was kind of pissed off because it's like I already cleared this area and now there's more raiders in here, but they were kidnappers. That's kind of weird. I got no guidance at all about that being a thing that I could do. I was just following some tracks. I didn't even know what it meant. It's going to be evening by the time I get there. Nope. Nope. Not interested. Nope. I knew the pass was a bit windy. Maybe it wasn't Nero's goal to protect people. What's the condition of my bike? Does it need any repair? Because if so, it does not need repair. All right. Okay. There's a narrow checkpoint. Also. Oh, there's no speaker up here. I hear some freakers, but I don't see any. It's getting toward evening, too, which is uncomfortable. Is 
look for some ammo. Good. Is this loaded? It is. Oh, there's some gas. Uh, should I pick that up now? Checkpoint's pretty extensive. Wait, what's this? Ah! A can! Woo! Found a can. All the ammo I can carry. Hmm. More ammo. Just in case I needed it. Strung those guys up. I don't know. Uh, how do I deal with those guys? What I should do. This. Everybody go check out the noise. Or just stand there twitching, that's cool too. Unbelievable. Not only did I fail to draw all of them, I missed them with a frickin' Molotov. That sucked. Where are you? Bounties. Where are you, buddy? Get down here. That was really freaking sloppy. All right, let's look around here. in here. There's definitely a lot more freakers around somewhere. Hey, that door's open. I hear a lot of freakers, but I don't see anybody. They 
sound close. Probably could have stealth killed him if I'd been paying attention. Was in here, right? Yep. I don't think this is even where I need to go for Sarah's uh, memorial site. But I am curious to check it out. Surely using up a lot of, uh... Oh, never mind. Yellow barrels. Can I get into this trailer? Yes. Oh, I gotta clear out apparently nine more freakers. We'll see what we can do. Whoops. Hiding in the grass. Can't see me. Let's get a rock out. God damn freaks, not here. You got that? You feed wherever the hell you want, but not here. This kid is It's not yours. You got that? Yeah, that's right. Oh, there's a lot of them. Back up, back up, back up. Did they see me? They're making a lot of noise. I don't think they saw me. Alright, let's use this again. Let's see if I can make it work this time. You sons of bitches are there. Huh? I got some of them. Any of you left? How many? There's a few left, Deacon. A few as in three. That one's sniffing around. All right. Two left somewhere. There's some heli there's a helicopter there. There's one. You know I could mark those guys. I never mark the freakers. Check that later. Okay, maybe I can check it now. Let's go! Give me the... Let's go! Right here! Lady! 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 
what happened here? I don't think that was somebody from Nero. That was the, at least a woman. She's described as a militia. All right, one more freaker. Let's go deal with them. Secure. That's the last of them. Hey, babe. Yeah, I, I cleaned them out. They won't be bothering you no more. I mean, yeah, until like they move in again, but sure, Deacon, whatever. Did I miss anything back here? I was thinking maybe there'd be an injector here at being a narrow checkpoint, and I found one in every checkpoint or research center I found. Nope, just ammo. It looks like some kind of transmitter tower there, but that's not my immediate concern. Let's go find that marker. before. Don't need it. Oh, hey, me again. Deacon, I gotta tell you something. Hey, it's okay. It's just my nerve. You told me that we shouldn't come back, and I didn't listen to you. I mean, I knew that it was getting worse, but I... None of us knew it was going to go away like this. It's fast. You don't understand. I don't know what I would do if I lost you. This is my fault. Hey. I'm not losing anyone. I made a promise. Remember? Deacon, wait! Sarah, come on. There's a kid here. Wait. Hey. Oh, hey, are you okay? Come on, we gotta find your parents, okay? Here we go. Yeah, they must have evacuated. Yeah, 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 they must have bugged out. Yeah, evacuated, that's what happened. Yeah, she's burning up. The uh, knife must have nicked her kidney or something. She's turning septic. Mm. How are you doing, mm. little sister? So stupid. It was this little, this little kid, this, this goddamn little kid. Big goddamn knife. Hey, help me. Mm. Oh, mm. We gotta get to the roof. Flag down one of those choppers. Right. Yeah, see if we can rest over here. Hey, mm? easy, easy. <sighs> she reminded me so much of my little sister, you know. Mm. So we used to play that hide and seek game all the time. She would just, she just uh, hide her head in her coat just like that. Mm. I've been good my name, but nothing like that. She's burning up. Jesus. Look at him. We gotta move. We gotta go that way. Ah. Uh, come on. All right. Hey, sweetheart, can you move? Oh, sir. Yeah, I got her. Go find us a way out. Okay, 
good intention. I'm gonna try to sneak up behind him, okay? It's nothing, it's nothing, Coco. I got this, go! Hold on, don't... Just... Fuck you! Yeah. Oh. Hey, 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 I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. Get out! Now listen to me, listen to me. My girl's out there, she's been stabbed. We're just trying to get to the roof. Get out and there's a helicopter you waiting. Her. So listen. You killed just... my wife! Oh, no, no, no. Look, I, I didn't know anything about you. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. 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 I'm Just killed a man, put a gun against his head, pulled my trigger, yeah, now he's dead. Wait, we need help, she's been wounded. What's wrong with her? Well, she's not, whatever the hell's going on out there, she's been stabbed. I can't take anymore. Oh, okay, listen now, Brian, if we don't get her to a hospital, she's going to die. There are no more hospitals. <laughs> Oh, come on, no more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteered for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here, okay? Brian. Okay. Shit. Uh, I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. Why you got room for two of you? We're overweight, okay? I can only take two of you, two. <laughs> come on, help me, come on. All right, sweetheart. It's okay. You're gonna be all right. I got her. Uh, Deacon, if only you'd shot uh, O'Brien at that moment, then everybody could have gone on the helicopter. Okay, Boozer, let's go. We gotta get on that guy. We gotta get on that chopper. I heard what he said. There's only room for two on that chopper. Go. Go with her. I'll be okay. Look, I've been through worse shit than this before. You know? Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Boozer is never gonna make it without me. Why'd I gain trust in Hot Springs for that? Oh, maybe because I cleared the freakers out of this area. You know... I think I mentioned it before. I've been Boozer? thinking about... Another Nero chopper. wonder what the hell they're up to. Wait, where? Oh, there. Well, we probably should check that out. Some time on my hands, made you some shit. Oh, Ooh, thanks. Nice. Yeah, I'll stop by when I can. Deacon out. When I get the chance. I... 
I mentioned this before. I wanted to to talk about some things about how they're telling the story, and I, it's just strange. It's just strange. That whole long cutscene. I don't get it. Why show you part of that cutscene at the very beginning of the game and not the whole thing? And the, why not show the whole thing in the beginning of the game or nothing at all? What information did that the rest of the cutscene tell me about Deacon that I didn't already know? And how the heck do I get out of here? It it really it didn't give me any more information about Deacon and who he is. That long cutscene really I don't think it was necessary. Because the short part that they gave you at the very beginning of the game told you everything you needed to know. Well, eh, I can't say everything you needed to know, but it really got the gist of, of what the extended cutscene was. And that didn't fill in any extra blanks. I don't know. I, I'll get into a more detailed discussion about that and make a special video about it. That was just weird. They have a weird way of telling a story. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Today, I was thinking about where it all began. The roots go deep. Back to the big WW2. 1947, the feds passed uh, what they call it, the National Security Act. Now, what this did was give the feds the right to take over our roads, railroads, and radio. Anything they damn well pleased, without a warrant. Today, the feds are gone, but we're still here. Shine the spotlight of truth on the world. Truth is, I've seen it coming. Years ago, we had photos. Nero death camps built to hold us, American citizens. No one believed me. If more of us had spoken up, none of this would have happened. Tell you one thing, it won't happen again. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Well, you're right about one thing, Cope. All these Nero refugee camps, they did turn out to be death camps. Just not the way you were expecting. True that. All right, let's track down that helicopter. Going the right way. Well, I'm following the mini map. collect those uh, spruce saplings while I'm at it. Oh, I got all I can carry. Hang on. There we go. Wait a minute. Holy crap, the helicopter's all the way back there. All right. Now let's head out.
closer. Try something here. At some point, I gotta try and do a donut. I heard a gunshot. I got gotcha. you. Hang on. I'll take this. Oh, let me just drop that. I don't need it. How do I drop drop it? Hey, dude. Sorry, you almost died there. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. You want to die out here? Look. There's a camp that... I'll go, I'll go. Where? Show me, show me! Uh, again, I want to gain trust, so go to Copeland's camp. Peaceful Lake. Mark Copeland. It's safe there. Thank you so much for stopping. I was so dead. I was never getting out of there. Thank you. Yeah, let them know it was Deacon St. John. They know me. Don't stop. Just keep out of sight. Did I certainly... Did I seriously earn, like... Ten trust for doing that. What a waste. Deacon St. John, this is Mark Copeland. I just wanted to apologize for that business with your bike. After the things you've been doing to help out the camp, well, I guess I had you figured all wrong. Again, I'm sorry. Well, nice of you to notice. Uh, let me leave my bike behind. I'll continue on foot. It's not much further. This is Copeland. Manny says he's got a part for your bike. Not sure I have enough camp credits. When you do, swing by. He'll fix you up. Copeland out. Yeah. He's got a new gas tank for me or something? I definitely want to go check that out. What the heck? You know what? Let me go back. I thought it was closer. Let's take my bike. Actually, I want to try something. Sidearm suppressor. Cool. Alright. Let's see if I can do this. I get a good running start. Oh, that was beautiful. I was wondering if I could pull that off. That's just bizarre. Jesus. It's like they... How can they not notice you? After I told you not to... Look! I... Just leave it. Alright, I'm just out hunting for each boozer. You got that? Bounties! The only reason that I go up there. Uh-huh. Damn it! Stay out of the way! 
Is that wolf seriously outrunning me? You're kidding me! Hey! I am not in the mood. He's trying to take care of something. Yeah, shoot. I'm gonna fail the mission at this rate. Unbelievable. I don't know what kind of wolf that was. The mangy feral. I don't know. Crap. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on. They're slowing down. Looks like they're stopping. Can I get off? It won't let me off the bike. I have to, like, drive right up to them. They have magic plot armor. I can't touch them. I mean, uh, that, Deep. that's... Deep, what's going on? Son of a bitch. What happened? You okay? No, no, no. He shot at me. I think they were just, uh, warning shots. I mean, if they were trying to hit me, I would be dead. Yeah, Deep. right. Remember me telling you about that death wish of yours? Yeah, 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 I got this. Dig it out. Yeah, Deacon, you kind of do have a death wish. supposed to go check that out well it looks like most of the herd followed them on so not a terrible deal let me find some cover there's only a few left but I got to be nervous about using Molotovs and stuff because that might just attract the herd back toward me I see five of them I don't know if I can hit him from here. There we go. There we go. This place. Oh, never mind. Oh, I keep getting the wrong bumper. My Wii weapon's about to break. It did break. Wow. 
Well, that was ugly. What is this thing? Okay, a radio <laughs> Ow, you blow. God damn it, get back here with that! Shit, that's mine! Ah, oh, finally. Jesus Christ, those shit's gonna run fast. I'm glad it didn't get far. So, what the hell are they doing? <clears throat> Looks like they were out here... Shit, wrangling freaks. I don't know. They had a newt and some kind of noose, like they were putting a tracking device on it or something. What? Wrangling? What, what do you mean? You know, like tying it up, taking samples from it or something, like those guys used to do on that wildlife show. Pretty fucked up. They got chased off by swarmers, bugged the hell out. They left some gear behind, a radio. Wait, you don't, you don't think that Sarah... No, no, not, I, I, I don't know. I'm just, and he's alive, Boozer, he's alive. O'Brien, one of them, Nero. I'm gonna track him down, if I can, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some answers. Damn it. <laughs> okay. Look, I'll be able to ride soon. I'll help you, Deke. If he's alive, we'll find the bastard. You're goddamn right. I'm gonna check in later. Deacon out. Okay, O'Brien. Where the hell are you? So I'm sort of lost. I was hoping you could help me out. I'm sorry, you're lost? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for the old Belknap Road and there's not a lot of signs around here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Nope. What? What is it? What? Oh, it's <laughs> great. That is just perfect. I think you broke it. <laughs> that is great. That is great. So about those directions? Oh, I'm really sorry. I, I don't know where Belknap, Belknap, Belknee, Bel Belknap. Belknap, that's the one. And I don't know where it is. I really can't help you. I'm sorry. So no, then? <sighs> nope. Okay. Well, thanks anyway. Hey! <laughs> <sighs> All right. <laughs> Could you use a ride? Yes, I could. Thank you for finally offering. I'm Sarah. I'm Deacon. Oh, well, sorry about the mess. Um, I don't. How do I? Uh, I like a greasy woman. Watch what you think. Just <laughs> leg over. Yeah. Okay. Um. There. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> Ready. Hey! <laughs> hey! Ah! Uh, hold on tight. You're a sly one. Thank you so much. No problem. It's just, there are no bars out here, so... Well, sure there is. There's a place called Crazy Willie's up the road. There's, uh... No, I meant cell phone reception. I knew what you meant. Right, of course. Anyway. So what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> you know, I ask myself that all the time. I do research. Um, you know, I study things. Thanks. Had no idea what research was. Sorry, um, <laughs> I do plants. You study plants? Yeah. Driving. Oh my 
got. Are you okay? I'm just... Oh, Lordy, that was close. Hey, you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just... Oh, my God. Hey. Hey. I've got cell phone reception. Hey. Yeah, I'm fine. I just... The car you gave me, it's a real piece of shit. I need a tow. I'm on, um, I don't know, some, I don't know where Road I am. Road 42. Road 42? Yeah, I'm, I'm about a mile up. Okay, I'll see you when you get here. Come on, I'll take you back to your car. We can wait for the tow truck. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Well, all right. I'm sure when those boys come back, they'd be happy to give you a ride, so. <laughs> okay, all right. All right, I just... Just give me a second. It'll be any minute now. All right, so... all right, all right, screw it, let's go. Just drive a little careful this time, okay? <laughs> you weren't really lost, were you? Well, that all depends on who you ask. My ex would say I've been lost for years. Well, you certainly know your way around here. You're not from around here. No, I'm from Seattle. The company that I work for, they just, they opened this lab here, so... Here I came to the middle of nowhere. To research plants. That's right, I already told you I forgot. Um, yeah, so, the company that I work for, they, they do work for this bioengineering firm, and um, some of the plants that I, I look at are pretty rare, and they just happen to grow here. That has got to be the best thing I've ever heard. Really? Oh, what the hell? Clay, we got company. Oh, shit. All right, gentlemen. Wait, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, I guess I'm doing this now. What the heck? I can't... I can't... Wait. Am I supposed to get beat up? I can't roll. I don't think there's any winning this fight. Uh, I'm smart so now, huh? Out here. It's big bad dog. biker, huh? Yeah! Badass, hit him again! Let me guess. Sir Nu's Jiu Jitsu? So tough now, I, I hope Sir Nu's Jiu Jitsu. You don't learn, do you, Mike? Oh, yes! Oh, yes! Oh, dude! I'll teach him good. Yeah, you like that? How about that? Oh, shit! Stay on out! Hold up! Hold up! Roll, goddammit! Go! Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. No, no, no. Uh, and oh that's God. why we have the Second Amendment. I'm so sorry. I, no, no, no. I don't even know. I just was looking in your bag, and no, it's I, I right. saw that, and I... Oh. oh, my God, I could have killed somebody. Well... Oh, shit. Yeah, but you, you gotta kind of aim it at them first. Yeah, I've never done anything like that before. Hey, I saw, it's okay, it's okay. I They're saw going. it in They're your going. bag, and I just I tried to call you the police, good. but there were no You know what we're gonna no do? Bars. We're gonna, gonna do? no reception. I'm gonna wait right here until your guy comes. Okay. Thank you. I've never done anything like that. Huh. Could have fooled me. Yeah? Oh. This is the spot, isn't it? Where they first met. That's what he reminded of him of that. That, that was what, the spot where they first met. All right, I think that's going to be enough for today. Wow, a lot happened. I need, to, I need time to process that. Hot Springs Camp, you there? I'm going to need more info on that survivor Larson spotted in Marion Forks. Deacon, I already told you everything I know. Young, a woman. Wait, he mentioned hungry gyms. 
That old pancake house by the East Bridge. Lumberjack, big stack of pancakes. Yeah, I know the one. Okay, I'll start there. You do that. And remember, bring her to me. A group of drifters came through the other day, traded us a few guns. Maybe something you could do. <laughs> Crying out loud! Freaking wolves! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. You do that. And remember, bring her to me. A group of creatures came to the other day trying to die. This is a very annoying thing about the game. Okay, uh, you were saying? You do that. I can't remember, stop for a freaking second. To me. A group of I can't stop for a freaking second. Traded us a few guns. I want to pause for just a minute and and just think. And I can't. Because wildlife will attack me out of freaking nowhere. Where the heck did those wolves come from? This is so obnoxious. It is not safe outside in this wilderness it's just not safe so anyway this is i gotta do this it's gonna be uh that's gonna be it for today and a lot happened i have a lot to process <laughs> a lot of stuff went down and i gotta think about everything that happened there and i just covered a lot of ground too i mean i was where was i i was freaking like up into here and i traveled all the way down to here which is crazy um I don't know what's going to happen next. I don't know what I'm going to do next. I'm pretty near to... Am I near that spot? No. This is the spot where that, that refugee was. And I might think about doing that. I don't know. There's, there's a lot of stuff going on. Um, I might, because I'm pretty close to here, I might go back to Copeland's camp because he said he had... Manny had something for me. <sighs> I'll find out next time when I'm on Shoes. Day's gone.